I'm Rainbow Rad, and welcome to another BuzzFeed quiz video. Now last time, I had no idea what I was doing. I don't even know if I'm gonna end up uploading that video, because I was kinda just vibing. I don't even remember what happened, I just remember I did one. That was a while ago. I am terrible at, um, editing videos as I make them. Uh, but, I saw this list here of 15 fall quizzes that'll make you feel all warm and cozy inside. And now, I don't know when I'm going to edit and upload this. It is currently almost October, uh, a little less than a week till October, and I am already feeling the fall best. I've been watching a bunch of scary movies, getting out my sweater collection, but let's see. We've got 15 quizzes here. We'll try and go through them. Well, I shouldn't go too slow. I'm, I'm gonna make this video forever long. Okay. First one. What's your fall aesthetic? Pick your, I know I haven't gone through these quizzes yet, so I don't know what they're gonna ask. They could be very repetitive, we'll see. Pick your Starbucks order. Black spiced coffee. Pumpkin spice latte. Apple crisp macchiato. Pumpkin spice creme frappe. Apple cider. Pumpkin cream cold brew. I haven't had most of these. I don't go to Starbucks often. I have a, ca a caffeine digestive issue, so I can't. I don't drink coffee that much. The last most past few times I've gone to Starbucks, I just end up getting the vanilla bean frappe or not frappe. Out of these, that does sound pretty good. Is that hot or cold? Or can it be either? I don't know. I think I'd go with a nice apple cider though. That's a classic, you can't go wrong with it. Pick your fave fall activity. Watching scary movies, going to a pumpkin patch, apple picking, or reading a book by a fall candle, going to a haunted house, or raking up leaves. Now see, scary movies, up until this year, I have not fully watched a scary movie, and now, somehow, I have, like, completely 180'd my ability to watch scary movies, because I would, like, try before, but then I would like, get, like, a panic attack, or, like, because I have really bad paranoia, so I would just, like, freak out and not be able to actually finish them. Up until this year. I watched a handful throughout the year, almost always with friends. Actually, yes, always with friends. I watched, like, two in theaters with friends. Um, and they were both newer ones. And then the past, like, two or three weeks, I've just been watching a horror movie almost every night. And I just haven't been scared by them. And it's weird. I'm, like, enjoying them. Most of them. Some of them are a little boring. And I'm, like, I'm gonna keep doing it. But, like, it's weird how I just completely flipped the switch of scariness off in my brain. And I don't know what's going on with me. Going to pumpkin patch. I've gone to get a pumpkin. I've never been to a pumpkin. Uh, a pumpkin patch, I would say. Apple picking, never done that. Reading a book by fall candle. I, um, I am an avid reader. I, I dropped behind for a couple years, but this year I've been good on keeping up with reading a bit of a book each day. Um, I don't usually read by candlelight. That, burning a candle for the smell while I read the book, then I can do that. Going on at house, like, this also, I really only started doing, I guess, the year before last year. Yeah, it would be the year before last. I went to my first haunted house, and then last year I went to a handful, and this year I've only been to one so far, but I'm excited to go to more. Breaking up leaves, I've never done that. Um, favorite of these... I'd say my favorite is going to a haunted house because I usually dress up all nice and, and by nice I mean <laughs> like the same like so in every I, I dress up that's about all we get is that my cat what's your fave fall movie the Addams Family Ghostbusters Hocus Pocus It Halloween Town anything homework classic I've watched this one once I think classic. I watched this one for the first time this year. That was part of my scary movie binge. I actually just got done watching chapter two. It was an experience. Halloween Town. Classics. 
like four of those, right? Uh, I don't watch Hallmark movies willingly. <laughs> Out of these, I'd say Hocus Pocus. I love that one. And it's one of the ones I had it when I was a kid. I had like a old box TV in my room and I would have it on Disney Channel almost the whole time. But at night, they would play the, like, I'd wake up at, like, 1 a.m. and they'd be playing these, like, the original movies. And I would never know what they were. But that's one of the ones I remember waking up to. And I was, like, terrified because it was the beginning where it was the girl getting, like, drug away. Not drug away, but, like, just while going off into the wilderness and then getting eaten by witches. Cat, will you please go off my desk while I have a candle burning on it? You're going to get your fur burnt off. You are dumb. What the hell are you doing? Ow, 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 ow. Well, let me put you down then. Let go. Alright. But yes, I remember that one. It gave me nightmares a little bit. But now it's one of my favorites. No! What's your fave Thanksgiving food? Roasted squash, mashed potatoes, apple pie, cranberry sauce, uh, stuffing or turkey? I don't roast squash. We have. We do a sweet potato casserole, and that's about the closest thing we get to roasted squash. Mashed potatoes. My mom makes them too often for other people. Thanksgiving food. Apple pie. I make a pretty mean apple pie. I would say mine is the best. But. Pumpkin pie has always been my favorite pie. Uh, cranberry sauce. I'll eat a little bit of it. My mom's got me onto that, but I don't really like it. Uh, it's stuffing. Pick your fave fall scent. Pumpkin spice, cinnamon, apple orchard, crisp fall breeze, warm vanilla, spiced chai. Oh. Oh, that's the last one. Okay, I was confused. Oh, these three. Cinnamon, warm vanilla, and spiced chai. Those are like my scents. Those are usually what the candles I get. It's usually some sort of cinnamon or vanilla or like chai. I'm going to have to go spice chai dark. You're a bit of a mysterious and independent person. You also enjoy staying inside to watch the leaves fall. You prefer other seasons, but this one's okay, too. No! This is my favorite season! I live for fall! Fuck off. <laughs> yeah, no. I, I agree with this. And I agree with this. This part is wrong. Rude. Evil. Incorrect. Feed, you suck. Okay, fall aesthetic. Let's see. Um, plan a 24 hour fall day and I'll reveal what fall drink you embody. Pick a wake up time before 8 a.m., 10 a.m., 11 a.m., 12 p.m., after 12 p.m. I don't know. Uh, I usually wake up around 10 a.m. if I can sleep in my how long if I can sleep in naturally, it'll be 10 a.m. But I prefer sleeping in naturally. Choose a fun day activity. Go for a walk, read in the park, go leaf collecting, go apple picking, go to a pumpkin patch, visit a porn maze. I've never been in a porn maze. And I don't collect leaves. I like going to I would like to go for a walk and then sit down somewhere in the woods and read. But I will accept reading in the park. Time to eat something, because I have to walk to the park anyway. So then. Uh, time to eat something. Soup, salad, burger and fries, spaghetti, sandwich, or sushi. If it's fall, I'm going for a warm soup. That, that's all it is. That's There's no if ands, or buts about that. Time for yet another activity to do with your friends. Go on a hayride, cut pumpkins, make s'mores by the fire. That's a summer activity. Decorate the house for fall, make a pie, go to a haunted house. Okay, well, I'm going to a haunted house. Buy something on the ride home. House plan, essential oils, fairy lights, warm socks, candles, beanie. These three, it's probably gonna be beanie. I don't even wear them that often. Actually, it's probably a candle. I have, because usually when my friends and I go to haunted houses, we stop at Target for a little bit to look at all the Halloween stuff I have, but like a candle every time. I have a problem. Pick a sweet treat to end your day. Let's see, you've got a slice of pumpkin pie, candy corn, caramel apples, chocolate chip cookies, marshmallows, glazed donuts. Not fall, not fall. Yeah, not fall. I used to love candy corn as a kid, but now it just tastes like wax. Caramel apples hurt my teeth. Slice of pumpkin pie. I told you it's my favorite pie. It's been my favorite pie since I was a child. Well, 
Mocha Mint Coffee. You're quite popular, Leo, for socializing and love other people's company. I despise mint. It is an evil flavor, and the only exception is mint chocolate chip ice cream. And this is not mint chocolate chip ice cream, so in fact, you're incorrect! Mint is terrible. It does not deserve to exist, especially in something as amazing as a mocha coffee. Like, no. No. Incorrect. Mint should not exist. It is evil. It, you know what? If it was just a little bit, if it just existed just a tiny bit for a little bit, okay, whatever. I just avoid you. But it is so pervasive. I go to buy gum, and it's all it's 50 different types of mint. There's no difference. It all tastes like the cold death grip of winter. I don't want that in my mouth. Check off how many activities you vibe with, and I'll reveal what percent obsessed with fall you are. A lot obsessed, probably. A, lo a lot. A lot percent. Check off the fall activities you do. Carve pumpkins, absolutely. I just said I don't go to corn mazes. Watch scary movies. Uh, wear a coat. Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't get the pumpkin spice latte. Uh, I don't watch. Football's gross. I don't do sports things. Take a long walk. I do that every couple of minutes. I don't go apple picking. There's nowhere to you go apple picking near here. Okay, I play the leaves a little bit. Yeah, listen, when you're going on a walk and you gotta crunch the leaf, you just gotta crunch the leaf, you know? You just gotta crunch the leaf. Uh, good old bonfire. I will have a bonfire. Or something similar. Get jealous of people with fall birthdays. I have a fall birthday! Ha! Bake cookies. I do that all year round. Make your own Halloween costume. It's called cosplay now. Go to your treating. We're... Listen, listen, listen. I'm too old to go traditional trick-or-treating. But I will walk around in a costume and take candy from the places, the, the houses that have it out with the please take one sign. And I only take one if they only tell me to take one. I'm not a bad person. But candy. <laughs> you checked more than 79% of quiz takers. Uh, I'm gonna put a warning. I'm gonna put a warning there for that uh, flashing gif and it is pronounced gif and i will fight you on that 100 percent full girl you love it fall is your thing you love the fall and do all fall all the fun activities yes i'm living for fall it's my favorite season okay i'm pumping through these a little bit faster that's good okay we'll give you a fall activity to try but you have to plan the perfect autumn day first okay First, when will you wake up? 9 a.m., 10, 8 a.m., 7 a.m. It's getting earlier. Whenever I feel like it, 6 a.m., 6.30 a.m. Jesus Christ! Whenever I feel like it, it feels like it. But I do... 9 to 10 a.m. is usually when I wake up. If I let myself, like, sleep in and wake up naturally. That is my natural waking time. It doesn't matter what time I go to sleep, usually. I mean, obviously, if I'm going to sleep earlier, I'm going to wake up a little bit earlier towards the 9 area. But, like, if I go to sleep at, like, 3 a.m., I'm still gonna wake up at 10. It's just how I do roll. If I go to bed at, like, um, earlier than that, you know, whatever. I'm gonna go 9 a.m. Uh, time to get dressed. What will you be wearing? A cute cardigan, a flannel, a jean jacket, just a white shirt, please. A nice, a nice blouse. Just a tank top for me. I don't get cold. Out of these, a flannel... But honestly, more likely just a sweater. But not a, not a cardigan like that. Like an actual, just a sweater option. What's for breakfast? A cinnamon donut, maple pancakes, avocado toast, just a pumpkin latte, cinnamon oatmeal, pumpkin muffins. Pumpkin muffins. What's the first activity of the day? Antiquing. I'll read a book for a while. Apple picking. Kayaking sounds fun. A short walk in the crisp air. Going to a coffee shop with friends. Short walk. Crisp air. What's for lunch? Sushi, pumpkin soup, panini, curry, croissant. I'm good for now. Um, I don't eat fish. I do. Well, if what I had for one breakfast with muffins, I'll go pumpkin soup. I've tried it once. I didn't like it much, but I might. I mean, I could try it again. I probably cooked it wrong, honestly, because I had like a was it a can? I don't even. 
remember if it was a can or a carton, honestly. It's weird. Uh, one more activity for the day. I'll knit, picking pumpkins, a hike, plain leaves, shopping for a Halloween costume, I'll read. Out of these, I'm gonna go picking pumpkins. I wish I knew how to knit. It seems like such a cool thing to do. Like, I want to learn how to knit eventually at some point. Right now, I just know how to, like, very basic sewing. Uh, what's for dinner? A full salad, butternut squash, mac and cheese, salmon and zucchini, shrimp fried rice, turkey mashed potatoes, just a pizza, please. Out of these? A pizza. Jesus Christ. What are these options? What's a fall salad? Ugh. Fall is too cold to eat a salad. I've never heard of butternut squash mac and cheese. I don't eat fish, so, and I don't see fish as like a fall food, I guess. Maybe it is, I guess. But it's not like specifically a fall food in my eyes. Turkey mashed potatoes, it, that is too much work for when it is not Thanksgiving to make a turkey. Mashed potatoes, all the time. What's for dessert? Pecan pie, apple pie, pumpkin pie, cheesecake, molasses cookies, no thanks, pumpkin pie. Pick one more thing to do before bed. A night walk, I wanna watch a horror movie. A warm bath sounds nice. One last coffee stop with friends. Nope, I'm ready for bed, just a few more pages. Uh, I wanna watch a horror movie. No, that's my boy Pennywise. A night walk, sounds like you're living a horror movie. Warm bath, uh, Warm bath is nice every once in a while. Just a few more pages, but I usually read before bed. Actually, no, no, can I? I was gonna say, I used to read before bed, but now I've been taking up, um, I wanna see if it changes. I've been taking up, uh, I read it, I do my reading while I, uh, I do my reading while I'm at work, like on my breaks or whatever. And then I'll do a little bit, okay, it's the same thing. Try a new hairstyle, there's nothing better than starting off a new season with a new hairstyle. Try bangs or change up your color. I'm literally dyeing my hair green later this week. Like I'm gonna be going from rainbow to just green. Fuck off. How dare you interpret my life for me, Buzzfeed. I've had this idea for weeks. It's not because it's Buzzfeed, I promise. Choose some food and I'll reveal your fall dessert aesthetic. Awesome. Cat, there is no room for you on my desk. Okay, choose some food and I'll reveal your fall dessert aesthetic. Choose a snack. Chips, popcorn, candy, cookies. Choose a drink. Pumpkin frappes, milk, beer or wine, sweet tea. I'll go sweet tea. Choose a topping. Marshmallows, powdered sugar, candy or whipped cream. Whipped cream. These are not going together, right? Uh, breakfast. Burrito, waffles, eggs, oatmeal. I love waffles. Choose a lunch, sandwich, french fries, pumpkin seeds, salad. That is not a lunch, that's a snack. I'm gonna go sandwich. Choose a dinner. Spaghetti and meatballs, baked potatoes, steak, or Mexican food. That is a very broad category. Just listen, 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 listen. I can make myself a baked potato. I don't eat meatballs or steak, so I'm just cutting those out immediately. Mexican food, are we talking like tacos? Are we talking like... There is this really good restaurant that I've been to a couple times with my friends that makes these really good chicken tamales. Oh, I could die for those. Ow! I'm gonna go baked potato. But, oh, pumpkin roll. You like sweet and salty. You like unique and fancy things. Cream, cheese, pumpkin, and probably cinnamon and powdered sugar. Yeah, I, that's nice. I've never, oh, I like it good. I like a pumpkin roll, but only like a little bit because it gets very sweet very fast. And also there's no salty in a pumpkin roll, but whatever. I agree, I'll take it. Okay, which, what fall trip should you take? Design your autumn aesthetic to find out. Okay. Um, it's time to bust out your turtleneck sweaters. I have a couple of those. <laughs> Um, pick a warm drink. What am I doing? Uh, fall trip. Okay. Just on your autumn aesthetic. Chai tea, green tea, steamed milk, Irish coffee, mulled wine, espresso, hot chocolate, pumpkin spice latte, black tea, apple cider, chai tea. 
I love chai tea. It's amazing. Take a meal to enjoy your fall produce. Oh, okay. Squash curry, sweet potato fries with hamburger, grilled chicken with scotch bonnet sauce. I probably said that wrong. Roast beef with garlic mashed potatoes. Kale and quinoa salad. Pork chops with applesauce. Ramen with cabbage. Arugula, arugula and fig flatbread. Um, pumpkin soup. Vegetarian empanadas with beets. Not a lot of these sound appetizing. I might try, I'd probably try that. I like sweet potato fries. I don't eat hamburgers. I don't know what a scotch bonnet sauce is. What the fuck? Scotch. Scotch bonnet sauce. Oh, it's a pepper sauce. Oh, it's hot. Oh, it's a hot sauce. I don't like hot sauce. I'm white. <laughs> Excuse you. I am white. I have the... I have a very tiny spice tolerance. Roast beef with garlic mashed potatoes. I love garlic mashed potatoes. I don't eat beef. Kale and quinoa salad. Again, stop with the salads and fall. It is time for hearty, warm meals. Listen, I live in a cold place. I want hearty, warm meals. Pork chops with applesauce. I don't eat pork. Ramen with cabbage. I don't like cabbage enough to put it in my ramen. Arugula and fig flatbread. I don't like... I don't... I, I haven't tried figs. But, like, who likes figs if you're not old? Pumpkin soup. I'm not a huge fan of, but, like, I'd try it again. But sharing empanadas with beets. Oh, I don't know how much I like beets, but I've tried those. Uh, I'm gonna have to go with the squash curry. Pick a class to take. Geology, yoga, and meditation. Nature, photography. What am I doing? Class to take. Geology, yoga, meditation. Nature, photography. Dancing, wood carving, marine biology, welding, classics, world literature, horseback riding. Out of these. Classics class. Out of these, I'm gonna go wood carving because I would love to carve some wood. That seems like a fun. Thing. I like I like handicrafts, but I'm bad at them, so it's fine. Uh, pick an indoor activity: workout, knitting, writing, chess, puzzles, making fall crafts, working on your car, video game, TikTok challenges, read by the fire. Oh, yes. Pick an outdoor activity: hike to f enjoy foliage, tailgating at a football game. Corn maze, tour winery, outdoor movie, hay ride and pumpkin picking, apple picking, farmer's market and petting zoo, end of season camping, bike ride. What am I doing? Outdoor activity. I like hiking. Um, that's it. <laughs> I mean, I like some of the other things. It's just none of them are what I would like pick first off. Pick a Halloween costume. Lumberjack slash Jill. Adventurer. Superhero, Magician, Viking, Mermaid, Butterfly, Witch, Robin Hood, Pirate. Well, this year I'm currently planning to go as one of my creepypasta cosplays that I've been making. Which is none of these options. Out of these, the ones I think I'd have the most fun with to make a costume for it would probably be Butterfly. But that would be hard to make. If I'd be actually. No, I can see myself making like, big, huge butterfly wings and getting like a black mesh or a black uh, morph suit. Uh, adventure. Some of these, these are too broad. Those are basic. Like, I think I'm gonna go with which. Pick a Thanksgiving dish pie, mac and cheese, glazed carrots, mushroom rice pilaf. Pierogi! Brownies put on the cob, turkey, shrimp appetizer, yeast buns. I love pierogies. Oh, I eat them all the time. Finally, pick a fall movie you want to see. Hocus Pocus 2, Black Panther, Wakanda Forever, Bones and All, Avatar, The Way of the Water, Medieval, The Woman King, Jasmine's Blues, Honk for Jesus, Save Your Soul, Halloween Ends, Pinocchio. 
What kind of Halloween fall movies are these? Is this Avatar as in like the blue people or Avatar as in Avatar the Last Airbender? Because that name is too ambiguous for either of those. Hocus Pocus 2, I'm really excited. I'm really excited for that one. Never heard of it, never heard of it, never heard of it, never heard of it. This just sounds like something that would be on like a bumper sticker. I've seen a lot of ads for this, but I haven't seen the other Halloween movies yet, so I don't, I'm not excited for it yet. Uh, Pinocchio. Hocus Pocus 2. Hike in Nepal. Fall is one of the best times to hit the trails in Nepal. The Annapurna region will take your breath away in the hill Himalayas. Isn't that a game company? <laughs> oh no, I have chronically online brain rot. Um, okay. I'm probably not traveling out of the country anytime soon because I'm poor, but I will keep that in mind. Just no, I won't. But we'll pretend I will. Oh shit, I'm only on eight and it's already been 30 minutes. Oops. Uh, we'll tell you which autumnal food you're most likely to have to put together a fall outfit first. Okay. Yeah, let me just go through. No, I won't. Okay. First things first, choose a top. Sw okay, there's only four options. Sweater, formal shirt, hoodie, button down shirt. Um, what am I doing? Because, uh, oh, hoodie. I have a lot of fun hoodies. Pick the perfect bottoms, long skirt, chinos, cuff jeans, baggy jeans. I don't like to wear jeans unless I have to, and I only have to for work. Otherwise, I usually wear sweatpants because I'm a bum, and I like comfort. And comfort is the most important thing for me whenever I'm choosing my outfits. Like, if I don't feel comfortable wearing something, I will not wear it unless I absolutely have to. Jeans, I absolutely hate wearing. They are uncomfortable. So out of these, I'm gonna go with a skirt. Why not? Time to choose some shoes, heels, boots, sneakers, block, heel, ankle, boots. So heels, which are uncomfortable, boots, which depends, sneakers, none of these are really the type of shoe I wear. Like, I guess technically they would be sneakers, but like, not the kind they're thinking of. Grab a jacket in case you get cold. I'm literally wearing a hoodie. Uh, leather jacket, puffer coat, denim jacket, trench jacket, or trench coat. Uh, none of these. Um, I've always wanted a leather jacket, so I guess I'll go with that one. How about a scarf? Blanket scarf, simple scarf, plaid scarf, knitted scarf. Uh, knitted, I guess. Finally, choose an accessory to complement your complete your outfit. A hat, a necklace, a purse, quirky socks. I always wear quirky socks. Uh, candy corn. Yep, the fall food you must embody is candy corn. The two best words to describe you are bold and ambitious. While well, you might not be everyone's cup of tea, you know exactly what you want out of life, and you don't let anyone get in the way of achieving your goals. Keep being your amazing self, and the world will be your oyster. Do we all do the exact same autumn rituals? Probably. We are a hive mind. I bet we all have the same fall rituals, and here's a pull to prove it. Pumpkin carving slash painting. Yes. Pumpkin spice latte from Starbucks. It's not an Uno. I would drink one if I was, like, get handed one. But I don't go out of my way to get one. Fall family photos. No, I don't really do family photos that often, honestly. Visiting a pumpkin patch. Not gonna s catch me sitting on dusty, crusty pumpkins. Okay, I don't go to a pumpkin patch, but I do go to get, like, a farmer to get pumpkins. I guess you could call it a patch. And it is 69. Fall hand soap or lotion from Bath and Body Works. I'm allergic to, like, a lot of bath- I get headaches from Bath and Body Works. I get headaches from Bath and Body Works! Okay, um, that's not the- extent of my allergies, I will get, like, red puffy face, and it is not a fun time. <laughs> I hate Bath and Body Works. I don't hate them. I love the smell. I love everything they have. I just am allergic, and it sucks. Binge watching spooky shows on Netflix. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell no. Not on Netflix, but I'll say yes. Whatever. Reading a fall book or listening to a fall theme podcast. Does Audible count? The only thing I read is my daily horoscope. I... Where's the option for actually fucking reading a book? Oh, it's 50-50, wow. 
There's not an option for actually fucking reading a book on here because it's just audible. Do you replace your front doormat to match your fall aesthetic? I don't. Okay, well that was not fun. Whatever. People are divided on which fall foods remain superior over the rest. What do you mean they're divided? It's obvious. I want to see more of other things besides just pumpkin and apple, but you know, it's whatever. Which pie is the best? Um, pumpkin, duh. What? What? Stupid Americans. Who the hell likes apple pie more than potato, er, um, pumpkin pie? Which pumpkin treat is the best? Pumpkin cheesecake, pumpkin ice cream, pumpkin bread, pumpkin cake roll. This is a two, uh, I guess that's a fine example. I like to make pumpkin bread. I love pumpkin bread. The other stuff is too hard to make. Pumpkin bread, you just get your shit together, you shove it in a pan, and then you bake it, and then you take it out of the pan, and it's there. And you can add chocolate chips, you can add little swirls of cinnamon, you can add whatever the fuck you want. It's your fucking pumpkin bread. Which fall food is the best? Pumpkin muffins, pumpkin pancakes, apple cider donuts, pumpkin cinnamon rolls. Listen, I love pumpkin and apple just as much as the next person, but why can we not have other fall flavors? Where's the cranberries? And I saw something about this. I saw a post about this, uh, and I don't remember what the other options they had were, but there's like other things besides just apple and pumpkin. Out of these, muffins, uh, apple cider donuts. Pumpkin cinnamon rolls, listen, they never taste like actual pumpkin. They taste like pumpkin spice, which, and usually it's the more fake version of pumpkin spice that doesn't taste as good. Which fall drink is the best? Apple cider, pumpkin spice latte, salted caramel hot chocolate, pumpkin cold brew. Out of these, the caramel hot chocolate, that's amazing. Fuck off. Which fall treat is the best? Pumpkin cookies, pumpkin blondies, pumpkin spice cupcakes, caramel apples. Stop being all pumpkin and apple! Which fall treat is the best out of these? None of them. None of these are super, like, I will go out of my way to grab these. None of these I would go out of my way to grab. I'm gonna go with pumpkin cookies, just cause why not? Caramel apples hurt my teeth. And which of these pumpkin foods is the best? They've all been pumpkin foods! Pumpkin cake, pumpkin bread pudding, pumpkin marbled brownies, pumpkin donut holes. This looks freaking good. But it's all been pumpkin! It's all been pumpkin. You can't say which of these pumpkin foods is the best when it's all been pumpkin! Now that it's officially fall, you have to fa find out which pie matches your hot girl autumn vibe. What? Okay. Choose the fall aesthetic photo. Long road. Fall trees. Leaves and more fall trees. I like the lake trees, so. Choose a fall outfit. Um, none of, none of, none. These the options suck. I'm gonna go with the sweater. Choose a hot chocolate. Just take off the, uh, like, Colored shirt underneath because it's sad, it's uncomfortable. Um, choose a hot chocolate. Uh, out of these, probably this one. That one looks good, but it's such a mess. So I would get that all over myself. Choose a pet to take on a walk. I love my cat. What the hell is this? That's a rat. I'm not the good kind. Now choose a pair of shoes. Let's see. You've got, uh, out of these, probably this one. Honestly, well, yeah, makes, yeah, this one. Finally, choose an extra fall accessory. Beanie, scarf, sunglasses, gloves. Out of these, beanie. Cherry cobbler, you're the wild card, and people love your spontaneous and bold decisions. You're spunky and probably the coolest one in your friend group. That's not, this is not true. This is fake. Incorrect. Apple energy, pumpkin energy, whatever. Which Halloween movie are you based on your fall favorites? Ooh, I'm almost done. I've got like four more, three more, 12, 13, 14, 15, four more. Okay, we're pulling through these. Let me tell something about you. <laughs> Scared me. Which fall movie are you based on your fall favorites? What's your favorite fall drink? Pumpkin spice latte, apple cider, chai tea, salted caramel latte, chai tea. 
go to fall clothing option. Flannel, crop top, sweater, spooky tee. I see a spooky tee currently. Sorry, I had to blow out the candle. It's trying to tunnel. These ones tunnel. Right? I mean, they're from the Dollar Tree. So, like, I don't expect much, but they tunnel so bad. Like, the wick is down to, like, here now. But this part is all just there. And it's, like, to the point that I could, um. Ooh, it's got a nice, uh, wax buildup, at least. But yeah, I need to like go at it with the lighter afterward to make the rest of the wax melt off. Favorite fall candle, pumpkin, cinnamon, fresh pine, cinnamon, apple. I'm not a fan of like fruity smells, which is funny because I'm literally burning a berry scented candle. Candle. I'm not a fan of like apple smells. Pine smells usually smell like not pine. They don't smell good. Pumpkin, I could be. I'm cinnamon. I like spice smells more than I like like fruity or like that kind of smells. Uh, what's your favorite part of fall? Changing leaves, pumpkin patches, decorating, candy, and food. Uh, I'd probably say food. Changing leaves makes me happy though. What's your favorite fall decoration? Pumpkins, candles, flowers, spooky decor. Favorite fall activity? Hayride, pumpkin patch, corn maze, haunted house. Best fall color. I'm gonna go with. I hate orange. Not, like, I, not hate. Hate is a strong word. I hate mint. Orange is my least favorite color by itself. In certain contexts, I like it. Like, I have this, um, lantern thing that has orange leaves in it because it's all themed. I like orange in that context. <coughs> Fuck. Um, I have a poster behind my phone that has orange as part of fire as the design. I like that. That makes sense. Orange by itself, I don't like. Which is, it's funny, because, like, people are like, but you have orange in your hair. Yeah, it's the rainbow. It's in context. It makes sense. I like it that way. Anyway. Um, best fall color, I'd say, is red. Friday the 13th, scary, while some like it spooky, you like terrifying. We all love a good fright, and some much more than others. Every town needs its Jason Voorhees, and it looks like it's, that's you. Does this mean I have to go on a killing spree now? I need to watch these. I need to get into the classic, uh, stop, 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 let go. Thank you. I need to get into the classic slashers. Currently the only classic slasher movie I've watched. It's not even a classic. I've watched the newest Scream movie, and it was an accident my friends and I were trying to watch the thought we the movie theater we were going to it was also on opening day it was the opening day of the new screen movie uh, are you a werewolf or a vampire eat this fall dessert buffet and find out okay uh, it was the first day of screening for the new screen movie and my friends and I were going to the theater and we were like hey this theater is supposed to have like this mystery scary movie tonight because that's the thing that the theater does on those on Fridays so yeah, it went, but then because there was that and another movie were both opening that night, so um, there were like huge lines, so they had to open up an extra ticket booth at the concession stand, and so we went to that one, and the girl there obviously didn't know what the heck was going on, and so we kept asking her for like the Scary Movie Special or whatever, and she just kept thinking we meant Scream, and we were like, whatever. And so we said, and so it's called Scream, it was just called Scream. So we thought it was going to be a showing of the old Scream movie, like the original one. And we were like, okay, whatever. And then it was the new one. And I was like, what the fuck? Uh, so that was my first full horror movie that I ever finished. <laughs> first, choose a warm beverage. Oh yeah, what am I doing? Uh, eat at the small dessert buffet to find out. Okay, warm beverage, tea. Pick some delicious cookies, pumpkin cookies, maple cookies, Halloween sugar cookies, macaron. Uh, these pumpkin cookies. Uh, what slice of pie are you eating? Pumpkin. Choose a piece of cake. Caramel cheesecake. That's not cake. That's cheesecake. Those are different. Chocolate cake. Carrot cake. Coffee cake. I am not a fan of carrot cake. I am a fan of carrot cake as long as there's no raisins in it. Raisins are the devil's fruit. Um, out of these, I'd probably go caramel cheesecake. Even though it's not actually cake. Whatever. Which donut looks tastiest? Maple donut, apple cider, cinnamon donut, frosted pumpkin donut, glazed donut. I'd go apple cider cinnamon. Choose a muffin. 
blackberry muffin, pumpkin chocolate chip muffin, apple streusel mu muffin, double chocolate muffin. But it's fall, so I'm going to streusel. Pick a random fall dessert. Ghost or pumpkin cupcakes, monster cookies, caramel apples, cinnamon rolls. These look fun. They probably don't taste the best, but they look fun. Pick another random dessert. Candy corn cookies, apple crisp, pecan brownies, s'mores. That's not a fall dessert. S'mores are a summer dessert. But out of these, I'm gonna go with s'mores. Finally, pick some. Halloween chocolate, peanut butter cups, Kit Kat, Twix, M&M's. I am a slut for peanut butter cups. Vampire, you're more like a vampire. You're sophisticated, elegant, and mysterious. You're also intelligent, logical, and determined to uh, accomplish your goals. You act on logic, thinking through big decisions before making them. Your strengths include immortality, flight, and enhanced senses. Make sure to avoid garlic fire and anchor humans with pitchforks. I can probably avoid like one of those out of the, the, the three. Which is a decent amount, I guess. Okay, two more. I can do this. From Infinity Scarves to PSL, it's time to find out which Christian girl, Christian girl, Autumn girl you are. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Um. Pick a drink. Cold brew with oat milk. Instagram ready latte. Pumpkin spice latte. White chocolate mocha. Iced vanilla latte. No. Only two of these. Oh, well, I guess three. I guess three of these are warm ones. I'm going with white chocolate. That's. Whatever. A worship song, good father, good good father, so will I see victory, reckless love, the blessing. I only know one of these, and that is from my church days, and that's reckless love, so we're going with that one. Uh, that always brought the old ladies to their knees. Pick a fall accessory, fall flannel, cozy sweater, oversized plaid scarf, cheetah ankle boots, trendy hat, cozy sweater. Pick your engagement ring. There are, the, these pictures are all the same. These are the same pictures. Listen, if and when I ever get married, I do want a band with a pretty rock on it, but I don't want a freaking lazy ass diamond that looks like the same as every other freaking one. I don't know. I see no difference in these. They all just look like a ring with a white shiny rock on them. I want like one of the cool ones with like the like a star eye sapphire or something like that. Whatever, a star sapphire or like. Give me, give me some, something with some, like, pizzazz, you know? I want some pizzazz. I don't want no boring rock. Also, not something that's gonna cost a small mortgage. I'm gonna go with this one, because there's roses instead of hands. What's your boyfriend's name? Josh, Cameron, Tyler, Jake, Adam. We're going Cameron. That's the only one I didn't know from someone named that with out of all of these names, that's the only one that I don't know someone already named Cameron. Except for like famous people. Courtney. You're literally running on dry shampoo and Jesus. Girl, everyone knows you're the wild one in the group. But that's why we love you. Your cardigan may have a few pill balls and your socks might be visible under your ankle boots, but you've got a big heart in the best scented candle collection of the crew. This is oddly specific and also oddly, uh, true, and I don't like it. Shut up. Leave me alone. Okay, last one. 46 minutes in. Shop for your fall wardrobe and we'll tell you what classic fall flavor you are. Okay, let's go. Pick a new shirt. This is a, this is a fall wardrobe. Let's remind ourselves, this is fall. Fall. COLD! None of these are cold fall shirts. And none of these, this is the closest to something I would wear. Choose a sweater. Again. Cold. I like this one because it's got, it's different. Different. Pick out a sweater vest. I don't wear sweater vests. But I like flowers, so we'll go with that one. Choose a pair of jeans. I already talked about how I don't like jeans in this episode. And why are they ripped? Why are there so many ripped jeans? Listen, my god, I don't like loose ankles. I like my jeans to have tight ankles. Uh, pick a comf comfy pair of pants. Uh, literally everything else I've, I've... Out of these, I'm going with joggers. I like tight ankles. 
on things. Choose a sweatshirt. That's why I wear like a lot of socks. Sweatshirt. Um. Okay, that's close. That's a close design to the sleeves. So it's something I have. Choose a dress. None of these are the types of things that are like. That one has flowers on it. <laughs> Pick out a jacket. That looks cool. Um, out of these. She's a pair of shoes. This is fall we're talking about. Fall where there's muddy, muddy ground and, and leaves and pick a scarf. I think they're mocking me. Choose some PJs. I think they're mocking me. I like I like the design on those ones, but I wouldn't wear something like that. Pick a bag. I don't carry a purse, but that's gross. Finally, choose a mask. Just go home. No one likes you. No one likes you. Salted caramel. You're a salted caramel. You're very trendy and always up to date on the gossip in your group. Everyone comes to you to rant and you love giving advice. Don't forget to take some time for yourself, though. We know it's hard being the most loved. Oh my gosh. That's all the time I have tonight for this bullshit. There were some opinions I had in there. That were opinions. I hope you enjoyed them. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I really appreciate it. It will bring back my fall happiness. And if uh, and that is all that I have for you. That I my brain cannot work anymore with the amount of pumpkin I have been eating under. Listen, I love pumpkin things. I will eat raw pumpkin. But please just calm down and think of like any other flavor combination this fall, please. Give me anything that is not pumpkin or apple. Even maple is cutting it close, but it's allowed. It's, it's allowed a little bit, okay? Just give me anything else. Thank you. That is all that I have for this episode. Bye!